All right, so I made this bearing because, you know, you can't just buy this type of size. You know, if we look online real quick, the sizes that we get are these really expensive, really big ones. And, you know, there's just nothing comparable to this right here, you know? So it's just a bearing. It moves and it costs me about eight cents, um, not including time, labor or electricity or anything like that. Or designing but it spins Ooh! and so this is just a tutorial I followed online about making it so it's gonna be very similar to that so here's how you go about making one inner race the outer race and then we have the middle part that looks like a crown the hard part about this is making sure that's not too thin and then that's big enough to allow it to fit with no friction but also it snaps closed and everything like that. Just a balancing act. What I used as my ball bearings were these right here. Uh, I found them at Walmart and I thought, yeah, I wanna make I wanna make some ball bearings out of that. So the way you assemble this is it's like some special type of bearing that when you put them all down here, it's big enough. But when you put it in the center, it's not big enough anymore. It takes 10 ball bearings. That's how I designed the crown. ChatGPT was telling me something about putting 22 ball bearings in there. That was way too many. It did fit, but just lining it all up was quite a bit more difficult. Now we got 10 in there. We need to spread it around a little bit. Yeah, you're really gonna need something, oh my gosh, something to really push these around. And you're just looking to get them closer to lined up than you want. Because you get them close and then the crown will take over. Okay, so the crown, I'm not sure what it's actually called, but that's what I'm calling it. And then you want to flip it over carefully. That way you can see it a little better. I did have one time where they all fell out when I flipped it over. And that was a mess. But as long as you have two on each side, you should be pretty fine from that. Okay. And now it works. So I'm gonna make sure the crown doesn't fall out. Because if the crown falls out while we're using it, it's not that great. But now it spins pretty easily. Thanks for watching.